Hey guys, what's up? What's going on? Today's Buzzer Ghost Cruise Fight Fair. So today we'll be opening up. Bam! The Sylveon V10, I guess. Um, These came out a little while ago. It's probably been a while for now. I've had this one sitting in my room for about at least a month. Um, I've been gone for about like three weeks. So I haven't been, you know, opening up stuff in like the last like two, three weeks really. Um and um but yeah we're we're kind of going back into the groove of recording and everything and i've been a little bit busy but um i've had some decent amount of free time so today i spent like two hours sorting cards i literally just finished every card up to holographics and all i have left is reverse holographics and then i'm basically done with my binders uh which is pretty good which means i'm about about, about halfway done which is pretty solid um and then after that i'll probably be, be sorting some like promo cards my promo card stuff um and then after that, i'll probably take 10 minute breaks so and i can actually start working on these cards that's gonna be tons of fun because i haven't really really touched those cards like just the actual bulk uh but we'll kind of get into that a little bit later but anyway today this is where we're opening up today i believe there's a sylveon um and then another couple of them i think it's not very porion might be fair flareon i'm not sure i think there's three of them <laughs> okay there is an espion and a uh, umbreon one uh, these came out for i believe rowing skies rowing skies evolving skies um and it comes with five packs a code card and then the one uh, of course a promo card here let's just get right into it and open up this bad boy um they're doing the the, the thing a little bit different more of like a strong plastic. But they open up really fast. I don't know if that's the right choice. And these are done with this now. Which is a horrible idea. Because you don't no longer get the super satisfying thing that I like. But it comes out pretty fast. Um, and the tin itself. Um, let's just kind of get closer here. I got this at Walmart. I believe at Walmart. A while back I think. Like I said, like about a month ago, or a little bit over a month. And we'll grab everything that's inside of here. I believe it goes for about $20 to $25, depending on the place that you go get it from. So we have Evolving Skies, Chilling Rain, Fusion Strike, and Brilliant Stars. Huh, we actually are opening up a good amount of Brilliant Stars, I have to I have to say. Um, even though I haven't even looked at the booster box or anything like that. Um, I always have to give props for these tins. I like them. They look good. Um, I don't know if I, how I feel this one's particularly because it actually has like the original color going through. Like the original metal going through the entire thing. And it makes it look a little bit more flat looking. Uh, but I get, I, I overall really do like the tin. Um, I, I think that's the one thing that bothers me. I think that's the one thing I might entirely I love about the, the tin. But I love these tins. You can fit a good amount of cards. They're not the best for storing. I do think Elite Trainer Boxes are better for storing cards and keeping cards sorted. These are still good. They look good. They add value. And I think that's important for a product that's so expensive. You, of course, get the Pokemon Tees. You, of course, get the Pokemon Tees. I'll just give it to you guys. You guys will get, of course, the Pokemon Tees G code uh, here. Um, you get You get that for the online code. I didn't mean to give it to you guys, but it's whatever. I'm probably not going to ever use it ever. And of course, this is what you will get for that. Sorry, guys. I was eating, not Cheetos, but um, something else. Oh, wow. And these fingers are red because I, I, I tend to I tend to only use two fingers. So I don't get my rest of my hand completely right. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> so this is the Sylveon V. Um, that's pretty cool. Um, I, I don't like that Sylveon is a, a psychic type. Um, I don't understand why why Pokemon decided to do this. I get it. I I, I get the, the reason why you got rid of Fairy type and Dragon type. They can be either overpowered or underpowered completely. Um, but then bringing certain cards into the 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 psychic version is a little weird, which doesn't bother me that much. But then you brought back Dragon type, but and you didn't bring back Fairy type. I find that super strange. It absolutely blows my mind that Pokemon decided to do that. Um, I don't know. Sometimes I don't understand what they do. You know? But it is what it is. And of course, the packs, Brilliant Stars. We'll definitely start with Chilling Rain, because Chilling Rain sucks. 
Um, we'll go with this one. Then we'll throw a billion stars, evolving skies. Nah, we'll, we'll do it like this. Chilling rain doesn't actually suck. I'm just not a big fan of it. Um, one reason is because I've also like own a ton of it and I've opened up a shit load. So let's just start off from chilling rain here. Let's just get right into it. Open up these packs. All right. So um, I have been. I have been busy sorting, and it's been pretty okay, actually. I'm not too bad. I've just been going through regular show. Um, I don't know why it kept, it kept popping up on my free page on TikTok. So I said, you know what? I haven't seen that show in ages. Let's watch it. And they're going through it. It's pretty funny. Luck Energy, Porygon 2. And it's also weird because the episodes are extremely short. They're like 14, 15 minutes. Um, so it's always weird because I actually end up throwing two of those episodes by basically a time slot of one episode for regular shows regular show regular shows that's funny but yeah cast form sunny form we have a kung fu there and at the end we have i mean you guys kind of saw that because i kind of fucked it up but it's okay uh galarian far-fetched surfetched i'm gonna throw this in the massive stack and then we'll throw this on the side <laughs> next one fusion strike fusion strike was a cool set uh, i we did end up pulling the the chase card from this set um which is pretty awesome um, but not entirely like something that I personally wanted, I think. Fusion Strike, yeah, Fusion Strike. It was, it's a dope card. I think there's still a, a, a an alternate art that we haven't pulled that's really good. But I can't remember from the top of my head. Schoolgirl. Oh, the weird guy. Som. Impidimp. Comfant. Comf Qfant. Comfant. Wow. Wow. Okay. Sandrew. <laughs> Mudkip there. We have a uh, Breloom Reverse. That is an uncommon. And then we have a non-holographic rare there at the end. We pulled this exact or uh, non-holographic rare last video, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Brilliant stars. We have reverses in this set. Can we get a reverse? Can we get a good card? Can we get a good card from this set? Um, this set has been weird. We've opened up a solid amount. But I don't think our, our luck has actually been that good for this set. Yeah, this... I, I, I don't know how I feel about that. I think that's absolute garbage. I think this is the dumbest... I think this is even... Oh, I hate that. I hate that so much. Clang. Torkoal. Double Turbo Energy. Starly. Spirit Tomb. Purloin. Milseri. Impidimp. Spirit Tomb. Reverse. That is a common. Sometimes it's a rare. And then we have a non-holographic rare at the end. Nothing too special there. But yeah, um, I don't know how I feel about this. I also find it so weird. This is a completely different design than the actual thing that's like plastic. Why? You feel me? Like, why? Uh, uh, Sword and Shield Evolving Skies. I feel like they should have done it more like how um, GX attacks did it. But, you know, it's not my place. Oh, this is Evolving Skies here. Can we get a really... Can we get... Can we finally get the Rayquaza alternate art? I would love that. Or 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 the Blaziken. The Blaziken Rainbow Rare would be amazing as well. Elemental Badge. Single Strike Scroll of Fang Dragon. Subat. Swablu. Lit Leo. Chinchow. Dino or Dino. Punkaboo. Ooh, our Carvana. Carvana, no, no, no. Reverse. Oh, wait, I'm going to get copyrighted. It's okay. Copyright my single video that I don't make money off. And at the end, we have... Oh, we actually do get a V card. I'm so sorry. I couldn't lift that thing up. I, what is this? Is this a fish? What is this? That's its eyes. Is, is it its mouth? Is that its teeth? I don't know what's happening. We get a V card. Yeah. It's like an anchovy. I don't know why I thought of that. But yeah, it's a big it's a big fish. Whale thing. Interesting. What? There's no was there any GX cards? When this card came into cycle? I don't think so. I think GX cards are technically out of cycle. Is that weird? That doesn't make any sense. Sometimes I don't understand. I feel like sometimes uh, so I used to be up to date, but not that much anymore. I don't really watch Pokemon stuff anymore. Uh, last pack here, Brilliant Stars. I have not really been keeping up to date. Um, I didn't really keep after about... 
I definitely didn't keep up to date for the little asset that came out. Um, it kind of just came out and I was like, oh shit. Um, but it's been a while since I've actually kept up to date for some of the cards here. A horrible energy, by the way. Executioner. I will keep, continue to say that. Ooh, friends. We Oh, this, this guy. Oh. Oh, this is Marnie. I have this. It's from Sword and Shield base set. I have a full art version. Debe? DB? Something like that? Dede? DB? Debe? Something like that. And then that's... That's the guy that makes you draw three cards. Hop. I believe. Oh, Weevil. Gibby. Gibble. Turtwig. I love Turtwig. Trap Pinch. Trap Pinch. Piplup. Shroomish. Well, we have a reverse here. And at the end, we have... Oh! I'll take that. I'll take that, boy. Ooh. That is a beautiful art, man. Oh, my God. Oh, look at that. It's not an alternate art or anything. I don't think so. At least it looks like a regular full art. But that is a beautiful card. That is that's a really nice full art. This is from Brilliant Stars too. Uh, that is one sixty five out of one seventy two. Um, so it's not a you know a something completely out of the ordinary. Switch deck off the three basic Pokemon cards. Shuffle them to your Pokemon V in any way you'd like. Ooh, interesting. This is a playable card actually. Uh, but that is a beautiful card. Um, oh, that's a that's a good pull. That's a good pull. I gotta put this bitch in the sleeve. Uh, but hey, good pulls for today's video. I ain't gonna cap. I ain't gonna cap. These are good pulls. Good pulls. Good pulls. Good pulls. Uh, but that's it for today's video. Um, I guess we'll show you guys everything we did end up pulling in today's video. Um, starting with our famous reverses. Uh, I do this out of just habit now like there's not much you know for some reason you guys didn't watch the entire video you guys can just come to the end and be like oh this is what you ended up pulling that's so cool we get a v card yeah that's so cool and we actually get an actual good card yeah that's so cool okay <laughs> oh wait isn't this isn't this him yeah that's right oh yeah baby I love these guys um but yeah man that's it for today's you guys uh thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like comment and subscribe check out everything else down in the description specifically my tiktok instagram gaming channel lego channel and the stream out down below if you guys are interested in donating uh what else check out my ebay page if you guys are interested in buying some pokemon tcg codes and it helps out the channel a lot um hit me up on instagram dms for any questions concerns collabs want some free codes i'll send you guys some free codes um i usually don't care uh thank you guys oh make sure to check out the giveaway down in the description thank you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one thank you guys